Hello everyone, we have here exponential equation. Natural logarithm of the quantity, natural logarithm of x to the power of x equals 1. And in this video, we'll be looking for the value of x. And any one of you guys who would like to attempt and solve the problem, feel free to pause the video, okay? And so how are we going to solve the equation and solve for the value of x? And so, okay, let's start. If you notice, left hand side of the equation, natural logarithm in here, there's another natural logarithm inside the parentheses. So all we have to do here now is transform this logarithmic equation into exponential form, okay? And so we have here now, natural logarithm of the quantity, natural logarithm of x to the power of x equals one. Natural logarithm is base e. This is e. And so we transform this into exponential form. So we follow this arrow right here. So e to the power of one is equal to the quantity in the parentheses. So natural logarithm of x to the power of x. So from here we move the uh, variable x to the left and constant to the right. So we have here now natural logarithm of x to the power of x equals e to the power of 1 is e. And once again, this is base e. So transform this again into exponential form. So we're going to have to follow the arrow right here on the counterclockwise direction or rotation. So this is now e to the power of e equals x to the power of x. And now, if you notice, the base is the same as its exponent. Likewise, on the variable x, base is x, exponent is x. What can we say about this? So based on comparison or correspondence, that's e is equal to x, right? Or the same way x is equal to e. That's our final answer. So now we have to check our answer. So we'll be substituting the value of x to the original equation. And so we have here the original equation and we have the value of x is e. And here we take the value of e as 2.718. Substitute this to the value of x in the original equation. So now we have here natural logarithm of the quantity, natural logarithm of e, that is 2.718 to the power of e. That is 2.718 equal to 1. That's a question mark. Actually, E is the approximate value. It is because we rounded off to three decimal places. So we have here now ln of the quantity ln of 2.718 to the power of 2.718. This is now ln times the quantity ln of this amount is equal to ln of 2.718 to the power of 2.718 that is 15.146 is this equal to 1 and ln of the quantity ln of 15.146 is equal to 2.718 natural logarithm of the 2.718 2.718 is actually value of e Natural logarithm of that is equal to 0 0.999 is approximately equal to 1. So this is actually rounded up. 1 is equal to 1. Or just simply leave it like that. Alright. So this just confirms that the value of x that we found is correct. x is equal to e. And so that's all for now that I have for you today. And uh, for those new to my channel, if you like this video, just don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more videos. Hit that notification bell so you get updated whenever I upload new videos. Thank you very much. Thank you for watching. I will see you in the next one. Have a great day, everyone. Bye.